Golfing World recently travelled to the Asbury Golf Club in England to meet two coaches taking the internet by storm. Piers Ward and Andy Proudman met as juniors and set up Me and My Golf to help people improve their games through online tutorials. On YouTube alone, they've had just shy of 80 million video views. We've known each other, played junior golf together nearly 20 years ago now, so set up an academy together and then obviously decided to move into this venture as well. We just, we just love coaching and reaching out to as many people as possible and the online stuff for us has really helps us to do that. Uh, when we first set up Me and My Golf Online, it was a, a little bit of a mistake really. We, so we were sending people away to go and look at other coaches online and then we said, well, why are we sending them to view other ones? Why don't we do this ourselves? And so we started putting stuff out there and. And it, we, we saw straight away that it was uh, engagement from, from people and, and golfers obviously just wanted to get better, they liked our stuff and, and then it sort of grew into a little bit more really, we, we were getting more and more response and the more we got the more we wanted to do and it just grew from there really but we never expected it to be in a position where it is now where we've got all these you know, thousands of followers now. But it's great, it's a, it's a great thing to do to know that you can put content out there and, and you're helping golfers all over the world. Okay here we go, one more. I love that. Very, very good. People can be watching our videos at any time of the day and, you know, golf lessons are obviously very important for people, but if you can get a golf lesson at 10.30 on a Sunday night anywhere in the world, then obviously it's going to be it's, it's great for people. And the, the, the questions, there's always you know, there's hundreds of questions per video based on how they can get themselves better. So there's this thirst for people to get knowledge and to improve their golf. And, we're, and it's very easy for us to create the content. People often ask us, well, how come you keep creating all this content? We just get the questions asked and we obviously just deliver from what, we, what we're asked. We're creating probably up to between, say, five and ten videos a week at the moment. Uh, so it's, it's, it's hard to stay on top of that, you know, but we're getting so many questions in. But I think because we're keen to get content out there, I think, you know, people want it every week. So if we can just keep, keep things going and, and vary the content, hopefully we can cover lots of different subjects. And we're never going to run out of bad golfers. Golfers are always going to want to get better. So if we can keep continuing to get that out there, hopefully we can just, uh, you know, help golfers enjoy the game a bit more. A great drill that we use a lot of our students face is getting the club on the ground behind us here and brushing the ground up. And this really gets that feeling of the shallow approach and getting that forehand top spin. We wondered what Andy and Piers enjoy most about their work as they look to grow Me and My Golf. We love travelling. That's actually probably the biggest perk of our job other than meeting the people that we're, we're teaching. But having the advantage and the opportunity, sorry, to, to travel the world, to see all these fantastic golf courses, work with great golf coaches as well and see uh, our viewers, that's really important for us. So we want to do as much travelling as we can to see these fantastic golf courses and, uh, and hopefully create even better content. So square on, more square than I would usually be, and really get the feeling here I'm playing that draw, getting that shallow interaction with the ground. See if we can get that ball sort of low and checking up into that flag. OK. Yeah, really nice strike. You just yeah, hear that good. spin on the ball, can't you? Yeah, that sound. Yeah, really good. And look at the ground. Yep. You know, I always heard a, a really famous golf coach once say that, you know, the best wedge players in the ground, they hardly mark the ground. It's hard to know that they've even been there. Well, we always say we, we don't have a method in terms of how we coach because we, we treat everyone as individuals. You know, we, uh, we don't believe there's one way to swing the golf club. So the content that we put out there really is designed to, to help the golfers sort of learn themselves um, and just see what works for them. So, you know, as we said, there's no one way to swing, but if golfers can take certain things from our content and it works for them, that's all we're trying to do.